Hi guys, welcome to quick guide how to use T1000 app. As you know, I was successful with my 1000 euro challenge, so I made a deposit 400 euro and my challenge was 1000 to achieve 1000 euro and I was able to do that at Casino Club. I needed in total 8 sessions for that. Well, it represents nice 150% profit and I always follow the predictions from the app and right now I like to a bit explain to you how to use the app and how you can play with some settings so as you know how to enter numbers like clicking clicking on that you probably already know right so it's pretty easy if you want to generate some random numbers like your casino is generating you can just maintain for example 10 numbers here and press RNG button and you will receive immediately 10 numbers generated like uh, from random number generator of the app what is the money management you probably also know I'm playing 20 spins for these 20 spins I'm applying progression aggressiveness 4% connected to my base bet and if I lose my 20 spins progression I will multiply my base bet 20 cents by in this case 2.8 coefficient and with increased base bet like 60 cents I will continue playing two times because length is two this is how the money management works and now go back I think the most interesting part is here like parameters what you can do and expect from here so I will generate a few more numbers to see some values so here you can see if the session base but field is green it means you play and if also this session spins is green it means again you play you are in the game and numbers are predicted this value here means how many levels you already burn in your progression in this case it's not much relevant if you play just one level but if you play for example two levels you can set up spins 10 and two levels so whenever you will burn firm first 10 spins and you will go to second level then here will be one like one level burned and still one remaining based on your money management settings bankroll is clear session bankroll is connected to your current plane session and bankroll is overall sum and summary how it looks drawdown is also showing you how deep you went when something was not going as you expected and let's continue this is this number here is showing you total spins so i generated 34 spins now and this is total number so it's counting all the time never going back so only increasing if you use the app and entering new numbers if I click something then you will see that it's going up and what these two fields mean so it's showing ratios so I'm actually cutting the all 37 numbers into five waves you can call them waves five ways and each wave has a four numbers and this number is the value of the ratio for the first wave the second number is obviously the ratio for the second wave and the same principle applies third wave fourth wave fifth wave currently there are zeros because simply you need more spins to generate then they will start showing some numbers typically always the first wave has a highest ratio the others they have a lower one this is the idea behind it so if you say for example I wanna play with wave number one then you can focus on this number but I will come back to that soon how it works so minimum sum wave value so you are saying for example I normally keep value 0 here which means app 
provides you the prediction all the time so you, you don't have any break or waiting period simply whenever you play you are entering numbers if you hit your number you receive immediately new prediction so therefore I'm using zero there is no condition then your ratio here it's a sum of for a sum of the ratios for the from the four numbers as I said every wave is four numbers and if I sum up the ratios from these four numbers this is the value right so and I'm saying I don't care in this setup whenever it's higher than zero or equal zero I wanna play so therefore you always receive prediction if you wanna play with it and saying for example I'm going to play only if my second wave which is this sum of the ratios is reaching 0 0.5 or 1 then you can set up here 1 and you will be and here you of course would need like this and then you would need to wait once this sum of the ratios is 1 otherwise you will not receive a prediction right this is idea I normally use 0 so I wanna always play here is the non-hit count you know already this value from other apps it shows it's actually dynamically calculated so it shows how many numbers didn't hit in and now careful what is in brackets is 33 so in 33 spins why because this number in brackets it's sum of these two values if you put 20 and 13 together you will have 33 and in this 33 numbers I'm showing you how many numbers didn't hit which means 15 numbers didn't hit in this 33 spins which is the last 33 spins which you entered okay so now back to the conditions first wave spins and second wave spins this number represents number of spins so if I enter 20 here and 13 it says please evaluate yeah, okay you are talking to the app right <laughs> please evaluate first 20 spins and consequently next 13 spins for me and based on that calculate the ratios so in total in this setup you are actually evaluating 33 numbers which you entered and based on that you will receive ratios and based on that your app will provide you prediction right if you set up here like one and one you are now saying to the app take just last two spins run the algorithm Pascal triangle selection and give me numbers so I as I said typically use 20 and 13 when I have the best results and I would also recommend to give it a try from your side but you can you can really play with it you can set up 20 20 5 5 or even different values it's up to you right and what is binomial Pascal triangle selection you can enter here values 1 2 3 4 5 these five values are actually representing five waves if you are set up setting up here one you are saying i wanna focus on a first wave if you set up two on a second wave and so on and here is one important key the app has integrated dynamic automatic let's say selection of a Pascal triangle you can say coefficient it actually works like that currently the best setting is done for first wave spins 20 and 13 if you change that significantly like to 5 and 5 it might work not the idle way therefore I'm recommending keep the values around between 10 to 25 30 here as well and it might work quite well important is that I wanna really have a as close touch with the table as possible therefore I'm dynamically changing 
Pascal triangle selection coefficient once I play. But if you say, for example, I wanna, my major focus is on first wave, which is here, numbers from the first wave. This will be also considered if the non-hit count is in a certain boundaries, like for example, 14, 15, 16, you will stick what you mentioned here. You will use the selection one. If, for example, non-hit count is going down like 13, 12, 11, then the app automatically will change that. If your non-hit count is going to up, like another extreme, like 17, 18, then app again will automatically change the value here. If you go back again, for example, to 15, and your first value which you entered when you opened the app was 1, and you are going to receive new numbers prediction, the app will use your original setting 1. Whenever during the play the boundaries are changed, like from 15, on hit count 15, you will go to 12, the app will automatically change the number here when you will have a new numbers prediction. This is an automatic change. So your initial coefficient is considered if non-hit count is kept in the standard normal values, especially for this 20 and 13 spins setting. And if it's not, if it's touching some extremes, the app automatically will change the coefficient. So this is this way for me works the best and therefore also providing them in the app and this is it this is a quick guide how to use the app i hope then you listen carefully and you are ready to simply give it a try in your online casino i'm going to introduce the app also in other casinos and record the sessions of course it takes time but i think so far what i've seen from the app and also the results with this setup Concretely like this one, I had the best possible results. If you, I stick to this money management, then 20 and 13 spins for waves, always receiving predictions and using like a first starting triangle selection four, focusing on wave number four, which is this coefficient. I received the best results, including my challenge, which I shared with you. So I would say thank you very much for watching this quick guide and I hope you will enjoy the app. See you soon. Bye.